Welcome! In this video, we will guide you through the process of using the XStim Spine Fusion Stimulator, a non-invasive, FDA-approved device that delivers an electrical stimulation signal clinically proven to promote bone healing after lumbar spinal fusion surgery for one or two levels. The intent of this video is to provide an overview of how to safely and effectively operate the XStim Spine Fusion Stimulator. Let's get started! Your XStim Spine Fusion Stimulator Kit includes several components. Two batteries, battery station charger, controller, electrode covers, electrode lead cables, one short, one long, electrodes, 20 pairs, belt clip, battery station power supply, travel case. These items are all you need to start your treatment. First, Select the appropriate length of the lead wire. Insert the lead wire into the top of the controller and ensure it clicks into place securely. Next, connect the two electrode wires to the two connectors on the lead wire. Each connector is designed to fit only one way, ensuring a secure and correct connection. Now, let's place the electrodes. Clean and dry the skin where the electrodes will be placed. Trim any body hair if necessary. Remove the plastic backing from the electrodes. Place one electrode two to three inches to the right of the spinal fusion site, and the other two to three inches to the left, ensuring they are four to six inches apart. If needed, ask for assistance to ensure correct placement. The XDIM Spine Fusion Stimulator is designed to provide 24 hours of treatment on a fully charged battery. To begin treatment, insert a battery into the controller. The XStim Spine Fusion Stimulator will automatically begin treatment if the battery is sufficiently charged. Remember to swap and charge the batteries every 24 hours to avoid any interruption in your treatment. Now you are ready to use the XStim Spine Fusion Stimulator and start your treatment. Once the battery has been inserted into the controller, XDIM will go through a self-check routine and will immediately start the treatment delivery. There is no on-off button. Please do not insert the battery until you are ready to start treatment. To stop treatment, remove the battery. Keep watching to learn about on-screen notifications and troubleshooting tips to ensure smooth and uninterrupted treatment. The XDIM device has several notification indicators to help you monitor its status. Home screen. Under normal operation, XDIM will display the following information on the home screen. Battery indicator shows the remaining battery life. Session time displays the length of time the device has been active. Completed sessions, number of completed 24 hour sessions. Disconnected screen. If the disconnected electrodes or wires notification screen is illuminated, treatment is not being provided and XDIM notifications will be activated. Other notification indicators. If XDIM senses a change in a state of normal operation, the relevant display message along with an audible beeping indicator and vibration indicator will automatically activate to provide information. Connection troubleshooting. If you encounter a disconnection notification, follow these troubleshooting steps. 1. Ensure the electrodes are securely attached to your skin. 2. Check that the electrode lead wires are firmly connected to the electrode or electrode cables. 3. Make sure the controller lead wire is properly inserted into the controller. If the electrodes are dry, moisten them with a few drops of water. If they are old, replace them with new ones from your kit. Ensure your skin is clean and dry before reapplying the electrodes. If the problem persists, contact customer service at 844-228-2067. Low battery notification. When the battery reaches 5% remaining capacity, the battery will turn red and the audible, beeping, and vibration alerts will automatically activate, indicating that the battery should be replaced with a more fully charged battery immediately to avoid any chance of interruption to treatment. Best practice is to have one battery charging at all times while the other battery is connected to the controller and providing treatment. To avoid gaps in treatment, ensure that a fully charged battery is always available. 
Thank you for watching this instructional video on how to use your XDIMS Fine Fusion Stimulator. We hope this quick start video helps you feel confident and comfortable using your XDIMS Fine Fusion Stimulator. For any further questions or concerns, please reach out to your healthcare provider or contact XDIM customer service. Take care and have a great day.